fact that Thailand has been uh, undergoing a lot of problems. And of course, over the past least 20 years, yeah. we haven't seen the significant reform in Thailand. But, uh, when it's come to concept uh, of you know, dealing with the economy, government uh, plays a particular more important in uh, providing uh, support for the SME. Sadika, welcome to Thailand today. I'm Kusumayo Tasmut. As Thailand today has been moving forward in a stable manner with political, economic, and social reform, the government has strong determination and clear framework in running its policies to ensure sustainable development and progress. The government also strives to undertake strategies and operational guidelines covering all aspects to create strong and sustainable democracy. So far, how the government has been making progress in solving urgent problems and in implementing its important policies our guest for Thailand today is Deputy Government Spokesman Major General Virachon Sukunta Patipak, who will talk about the progress of the government's policies to undertake the national reform in all aspects and implementing the resolutions of urgent issues. Please join me to welcome Deputy Government Spokesman Major General Virachun Sukhanta Patipa with us here today. Sawadika. Sawadika. Very warm welcome to Thailand today, sir. Very. Uh, thank you very much for having me with your program. It's wow. been a great honor for me. <laughs> oh, it's a good for us because it's very important that we wanted to know that the government of Thailand has been making progress in solving urgent problems in the implementation of its policy. So uh, you are here yes. to answer to all that. <laughs> all <right>? I'll try. <laughs> I'll try. All right. So we're going to have ask you for the first question. Between uh, political, economic, and social reforms, which one has been moving forward in a stable manner? Well, it is quite difficult to answer this question, mm -hmm. uh, given the fact that Thailand has been uh, undergoing mm. the, you know, a lot of problems. And of mm. course, uh, over the past at least 20 years yeah. we haven't seen the significant reform uh -huh. in thailand yes and this government you know come yeah, step in uh, when we have a lot of problem mm -hmm. we were at the deadlock and we try to um you know unlock the deadlock and in order to move the, the country forward so let me uh answer your question this way mm -hmm. Uh, right now, we uh, satisfy. We are satisfied. We satisfy with the progress that okay. we uh, made uh, mm -hmm. concerning the reform program yes, of, of the country at the uh, moment. Uh, but apart from what you have mentioned, uh -huh. uh, the the uh, politics, yes. economy, mm -hmm. and social, mm -hmm. we also put particular importance on uh, law and justice procedures, mm. and uh, all areas are interconnected. Mm. And talking about the, the stable manner, I'd rather say that the, uh, the reform po program in mm. Thailand is uh, formidable, mm. but necessary. Mm -hmm. uh, therefore, uh, everything moving into the right direction. Mm. But as I mentioned to you, mm. it is formidable. Uh, it cannot be uh, that easy. Mm. It is a daunting task. Uh -huh. uh, we, uh, let me put my answer that uh, we are quite happy of what we are doing now uh -huh. and we believe that uh, you know, asking if um, it is bad fruit to the people or mm -hmm. not, mm -hmm. I am not in a position to answer mm -hmm. this question. But the people would also, would, I mean, this uh, answer requires you know, the, the people to, to answer the question. I'm we are um, representing part of the people. Just to tell you that, because uh, for the people in 177 countries worldwide, uh, you should know that uh, the Thai people is now do not face such uh, progress f so far. I mean, we have done not that bad, not that good. But uh, uh, in terms of education, we could see something change. We could see the uh, well, the many other uh, social issues have been changed. But the uh, only thing of the economically that we have to be going on anyway. Mm -hmm. So on the economy mobilization, what expect the government has placed 
must expect actually uh, the government has placed it for the first priority we expect the long term development mm -hmm. at the same time we also tackle the uh, short term uh, problem mm -hmm. uh, we are now facing the uh, the global uh, economic downturn. Mm -hmm. uh, therefore, uh, we need to to provide support to our, um, you know, farmers. Mm. Why? Mm. Because Thailand is the agricultural based country, mm -hmm. you know, and the pr the price of the agricultural products or the commodity mm. is low. Not yeah. only in Thailand, but okay. it is low across the globe. Okay. Uh, yeah. We need to to tackle this problem in uh -huh. order to, um, you know, support to look after the low earner, mm. uh, low income oh. earner. Mm. But uh, when it's come to concept uh, of you know, dealing with the economy, mm. we uh, place particular importance on sustainable development. Mm. You know, yes. uh, in order to, to um, deal with the problem sustainably, yes. not just the, the long term, mm. uh, not just the short term mm. uh, gain, mm. uh, we have to say that uh, our policy is quite different from, from the previous policy. Uh, our policy is not populist mm -hmm. we, because we emphasize on, on uh, long-term gain mm -hmm. or sustainable, mm -hmm. not just the short-term gain, mm -hmm. as I mentioned. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So at the moment, when you, when you touch down to the, the farmer, mm -hmm. so at the moment, the uh, situation of droughts has gone. Mm -hmm. So it's okay, we have uh, enough water to uh, irrigation and all that? It be all right? It is all right now, mm -hmm. but uh, as I mentioned, that uh, government look at mm -hmm. uh, government policy mm -hmm. plays particular important on on long term or sustainable de development. Yes, uh, yes. We want our farmer mm -hmm. to uh, move on mm -hmm. or to become like um, the smart farmer, mm -hmm. meaning uh, they would have to. Um, learn more, mm. they would have to gain more high they technology, high technology. Yeah, yeah. they would have to, to uh, you know, involve technology mm. in mm. their, uh, uh, you know, their, their production, uh, production mm. something like that. Mm. And of course, uh, in doing this, we also, uh, in order to become a smart farmer, mm. the government have facilitate uh, this you know, move mm. by uh, providing the, uh, what we call the agri map. Mm. Or agricultural oh, map, agri ah, map. What is like? This will enable or will inform. Uh, this map will tell the farmer where, when, and how ah. they would do their farming. Oh, great! They would know that uh, what amount of of, of water ah. they would have at oh. this uh, time of the year, ah. or uh, which is um, you know, what kind of crop that need to be. Uh, you know that that that. That, uh, that particular time, the particular on season. that particular time, on the particular uh, season, mm. because it will allow uh, the farmer to ensure it will uh, it will ensure, uh, assure the, pe the the farmer that yeah. uh, they would have the um, you know stable income. Mm, that is a great this kind of thing, it uh. is available now through mm. the um, G or the Golf Channel E Golf Channel. Mm. Farmer can, can get uh, this kind of information uh -huh. uh, throughout the country, in yeah. every country. Uh -huh. And of course, apart from providing this um, agri map, okay. we also uh, establish the uh -huh. um, learning center uh -huh. in order to, to you know, provide them knowledge on technology, mm -hmm. how to apply technology, mm -hmm. how to create the value added to their mm -hmm. product. Because in the old day, uh, we already, I mean, we, we just, um, import or we just sell uh, the the commodity product okay. i mean we sell uh, in the old day we we i remember i still can recall uh, that uh, in the classroom uh, i have to answer the question that uh, <laughs> the main uh, uh, export product of thailand uh, would be rice yeah, rubber uh, 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 sugar cane uh, 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 yeah, this kind of thing uh, yeah. or, or um, potato uh, but right now we have to move you know uh, mm. across that mm. we have to involve uh, I mean, provide the farmer with technology mm -hmm. in order for them to, to earn more income. Mm -hmm. And of course, uh, mm -hmm. they would be able to compete uh, mm -hmm. with the other country. Mm -hmm. uh, by providing them with this mm -hmm. uh, platform, mm -hmm. uh, would be able to, to increase the competi competitiveness of mm -hmm. the countries as well. The su substitution plant also come mm -hmm. into your scheme, I think. Mm -hmm. The government scheme mm -hmm. for the future. Right. Yes. That is very interesting. Mm -hmm. well, no, we have here that uh, we have heard such uh, such a progress. This is called. But how do the farmer reacts to this? Are they happy? Mm -hmm. Of course. It is never happened. This is the first I ever. I rather uh, put the answer in this way. 
change is something that people are reluctant to, mm -hmm. you know, because but people uh, have been um, living in uh, in the the same environment for mm -hmm. quite some time, and they feel like this is the the comfort zone. Okay. When it's come to change, they would feel <laughs> like um, they would have some question: uh. Would it be okay? Mm -hmm. uh, will I get the benefit? Mm -hmm. Will my life uh, would be uh, will my life be better? Mm -hmm. Will I gain more income? Mm -hmm. But the government, uh, you know, try to provide awareness mm. and knowledge to these mm. people. Mm. We are not just uh, telling them what to do, how to do, when to do, but mm. we also provide them knowledge, we also mm. provide them information to create the awareness among the farmers, among uh, those uh, low-income earners. This is one of the uh, very, what you call, a uh, very prosper and very good news mm -hmm. um, to, the, to the farmer, which is the backbone of the country. So, we're talking about Pracharat, and um, I'm sure because our audience may not understand. So can you go down to what is Pracharat scheme so far? Well, Pracharat is, uh, you know, it's in Thai, but in English mm -hmm. it's PPP, meaning uh -huh. uh, people, public, private partnership. Uh -huh. It's the um, a cooperation between uh -huh. public sectors, uh -huh. uh, private sectors, and also uh -huh. government public sectors uh -huh. and the um, you know, communities to work together in order to support uh, one another. Uh -huh. This is a cooperation among all sectors in the society. Mm. Uh, asking why it has to be Pacharat, mm -hmm. uh, because the mm. key concept or idea of uh, the policy is to mm. reduce the disparity in the social mm. or the, I, mean, I mean the reduction of the social disparity mm. um, this will um, allow people to work together mm. it also um, you know help in terms of uh, reconciliation you know it will allow people from uh, from all sectors walks of life or walks of life to mm. work together and mm. to share uh, their knowledge to mm. share their um, you know practice mm. and to share their common understanding and mm. get to know uh, mm. and ap and appreciate one another mm. So this is the first ever scheme that we have in this government, sort of, it is the first time? I think this is the first ever oh. because in oh. the past uh, we uh, have been receiving the, uh, you know, uh, policy oh. which is uh, provide uh, benefit for people but it is, you know, short term, short -term gain oh. uh, which is known as the um, Prashaniyom or populism yeah. mm -hmm. and populism can add, mm. I mean as mentioned to you earlier mm. that uh, it is short term gain mm. but the Pacharat uh -huh. or the PPPP is the long term gain and the uh -huh. sustainable way of uh, you know dealing with the problem mm -hmm. and su sustainable way of development mm -hmm. and of course uh, this will be uh, you know uh, integration of all uh, civil society we really seems to be in good hands with the government in many fields because we've been talking about uh, the implementation and sustainability of, uh, of the backbones of the country by farmers and all that. And uh, we talk about uh, many progressing things that's happening in Thailand. Uh, so, but we need you to explain the progress of the another key infrastructure like water development projects that we've been doing and we could see that you know the uh, expressway had been true everywhere we're talking What's about there? about infrastructure development uh. um according to my my experience uh -huh. you know i accompany um prime minister mm. to every meeting i mean international meeting okay. bilateral and multilaterally uh -huh. um every forum this guy are talking about promoting mm. connectivity mm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. you know in all dimension mm. um, land ah. air ah. Uh, water okay. and um, road what else? road of ah. land, I love land of course, sorry. Ah. people ah. believe that the uh, connectivity is ah. the important a must to must. have mm. now mm. today mm. in order to to create stability uh, so sorry mm. in order to create prosperity mm. among um, countries between regions and among regions mm. and Thailand is now um, you know receive we are we receive the the particularly important from 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 our friend our international friend mm. according to our geographical location mm. the other country or our friend seen Thailand as the uh, 
a center as the hub of of ASEAN mm. because our location. Yes, we, we are, are able to uh, you know link or to connect mm -hmm. uh, whoever come to invest in Thailand mm -hmm. or to work with Thailand mm -hmm. to the other country. Mm -hmm. We are uh, border with <coughs> uh, Malaysia, mm -hmm. Cambodia, Laos, Myanmar, mm -hmm. and of course, uh, China? considering uh, our, lo uh, uh, our geographic location, okay. we have yeah. the potential to connect mm -hmm. uh, ASEAN with country outside outside ASEAN. ASEAN. Mm. For Any example, class? to India, uh -huh. to China. Mm. Uh, for example, this is this is one, one mm. example. Mm. And therefore, government mm. uh, realized the importance of, of connectivity. Mm -hmm. We are now, um, <coughs> there are, pl I think, at least um, six mega project um, mm. of connectivity mm. in the pipeline. Mm. You know, we have yes. you know, managed to, to uh, come to the agreement of the, uh, the road Mm. Intercity, in, intercity, and mm -hmm. and uh, you know, inter, international. Interna I mean, yes, among international, okay. among, among the country, okay. um, not between Thailand to Laos to Vietnam, for example. Yeah. The the road network, uh -huh. the railway uh, network, uh -huh. the uh, waterway transportation. Uh -huh. uh, for the road network, we uh, have managed to, you know, uh, to form the the road network in order to link. Um, region mm. yes, to from city into uh, region city within the region like and of mm. course we have managed to talk to our uh, neighboring country in order to to transport uh, goods and people from uh -huh. Thailand to Laos and to from Laos to Vietnam this is mm. one example mm -hmm. and other than that uh, we have managed to um, you know uh, establish the 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 railway mm. network mm. not uh, so, sorry, uh, east to west, mm -hmm. uh, not to south. Mm -hmm. uh, we would be working with Japan mm -hmm. in order to, to create that kind of network. Mm -hmm. And of course, uh, we, in, apart from linking uh, Thailand from, you know, uh, south from east to uh, west to east, east, for example, east. Uh. we would be able to link Thailand into uh, Myanmar mm -hmm. to the uh, Dawei uh, mm -hmm. project or mm -hmm. Dawei, Dawei. Dawei Special Economic Zone. Yeah. Uh, that kind of thing happened during this, um, you know, under this government. Uh -huh. And other than that, we also place particular impo importance on the uh, mass transport sy system. Mm -hmm. The uh, electric train in mm -hmm. Thailand mm -hmm. has been um, implemented mm -hmm. and of course, uh, it would bear fruit in a very short time. So um, this government plays particularly important on the logistic system in order mm -hmm. to create connectivity, mm -hmm. not only within the country, but mm -hmm. also uh, between Thailand and other countries within in the region as well. Mm -hmm. This is uh, uh, aiming at to create country competitiveness mm -hmm. and, uh, and to make Thailand become the uh, place of ease of doing business. Mm -hmm. So Thailand, um, Deputy Governor Spoman repeatedly saying that Thailand can be a place where you can invest with a, uh, with a what they call fast going city kind of thing. So uh, we've been talking about the good side of that and mm -hmm. uh, we still have to solve a little problem on the labor. Mm -hmm. So what, how about uh, progress or in resolution for labor problem? in fishery or in many other industries? Yes. Well, this is a very good question. Mm -hmm. Of course, uh, the key policy of this government is, um, you know, addressing the problem as mm -hmm. the, the root cause of the problem. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. Therefore, and of course, uh, when it comes to labor, uh, workers' problem, mm -hmm. we see that we realize that uh, they all are very important to mm -hmm. our country, I mean, the, to the country's economy. Mm -hmm. uh, the migrant uh, workers mm -hmm. has been uh, yes. you know, a major factor in driving country's economy. Mm -hmm. And in the past, uh, we have to accept that uh, this problem has been neglected mm -hmm. and, uh, you know, lived unattended for many years. Mm -hmm. And yes. uh, the progress exactly. of, of, of uh, solving or dealing with this problem, mm -hmm. I like to say that uh, it starts with we accept mm -hmm. that we have a problem. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We have to accept the yes. We have to accept yes, the problem, yes. and mm -hmm. we find out. The, we look at the problem. We ad address the root cause of the problem, mm -hmm. and uh, this government has come to uh, you know many 
many uh, measures. We mm. have d delivered many measures in order to deal with this problem. We have managed to uh, register mm. all of those migrant workers mm -hmm. in order for them to receive yeah. the, the the basic rights. Uh, you know. uh, like, b do we they do they do they entitled to have a. Uh, what you call the sick sickness hospitalized and all that something like that and for that the, the, the the education, education. the um the hospital oh. the medical care, medical care yes. and uh, uh any any all form of social st uh, oh. social security uh, mm, okay. that that uh, you know would allow people to live their life mm. uh, happily mm. and uh, we have managed to talk to our uh, neighbor like mm. uh, Myanmar, yeah, yes. like Cambodia, like Vietnam. Laos, like Vietnam, mm. that okay, we assure them that uh, uh, we ask them to, to uh, cooperate with us in order for Thailand to solve this problem mm. more effectively. Mm. Uh, for example, uh, they should be able to identify, identify nationality of mm. those uh, migrant workers before coming to Thailand. Mm. And when uh, they arrive Thailand, mm. we would know exactly yes. uh, the country of origin. We would mm. have the, the identity. We would mm. be able to uh, put them in the system mm. right away mm. after being registered. Mm. This kind of cooperation between yeah. Thailand and neighboring countries has been uh, in a very uh, big progress and, effect and, and effective. Mm. So ca I can assure to you that uh, uh, we would have uh, you know, enough uh, migrant worker or workers to uh, the country's economy. And of course, we are able to ensure our foreign friend that uh, uh, when uh, you people, I mean, from overseas coming to work in Thailand, mm -hmm. they would be well looked after. Mm -hmm. You heard that? So anyway, uh, we still have a, another uh, concern that is about education. So government, how does the government uh, foresee that in 15 years, all fee education that we are supposed to do it, and this is a scheme to help out the student from dropping off or something? Like well, I think quitting school yes. or dropping off from the school mm. is a different issue from the uh, uh, 15 years free education. Uh. Uh, 15 years free education uh, happened for the first time in this uh. country. Uh -huh. uh, I'm talking about the government policy and mm. it is an act as the law, mm -hmm. the law of this country that every children mm. uh, you know, in this country mm -hmm. or Thai nationality mm -hmm. would receive the uh, 15 year free education. Mm. It is a basic right for, mm. for every children yes. to receive the, the education. It would allow them to, um, to, to be sure that, that they would have a, a bright future, mm -hmm. they would have you know, enough uh, tool mm -hmm. for them to, to, to live their life. Mm -hmm. and to make the progress in their life. Mm -hmm. But uh, it depends on other problems mm -hmm. when it comes to, uh, you know, uh, quitting school or not. Uh, that this is their business <laughs> that, that we have to... It's not their business. Oh, uh, we, I don't want to say that way, but uh, it would be another f the other factors involved. Mm -hmm. For example, um, you know, um, the need the family, of uh, environment, mm -hmm. and they also need to, to uh, take responsible uh, you know, self responsibility mm -hmm. as well, mm -hmm. and family need to look after them closely. Mm -hmm. uh, government already provide the platform for them uh, in order to have a brighter future. Mm -hmm. Deputy Governor, Deputy Government mm -hmm. spokesman, is confirmed to us that this government will not leave anyone behind. We are eating up. I thank you so much to Deputy Government Spokesman Major General Virachun Sukunta Patipak. Thank you so much for being here, sir. If at all you have anything to convey after you're returning from Mongolia, you can very well be well, here. Well, thank you very much. Thank, thank you, you for having me today with you. Thank you so much. Thailand today would like to say thank you very much to Deputy Government uh, Spokesman Major General Virachun Sukhonta Patipak, who has explained how the Thai government has been making steady progress in implementing its policies to undertake the national reform in political, economic and social aspects, so in all resolutions for urgent problems. Thank you very much for watching Thailand today. I'm Kusumayo Thasmo. Talk to you again, same place, same time. So, Dikat.